In the late 1960s, archaeologists made a remarkable discovery on the island of Santorini. Hidden beneath layers of volcanic ash, they unearthed what are now commonly known as the Akrotiri frescoes. The city of Akrotiri had been buried under layers of volcanic ash and pumice since the eruption of the Thera volcano in the mid-second millennium. It wasn't until 1967 when Greek archaeologist Spiridon Marinados excavated the site. He had previously excavated at Knossos, the largest Bronze Age site on the island of Crete, and was familiar with the Minoan civilization that had flourished in the Aegean region during the Bronze Age. Marinatos and his team began his excavation of Akrotiri in 1967 and quickly uncovered evidence of a sophisticated urban civilization that had been buried under the ash of the Thera volcanic eruption. Aside from the well-preserved buildings, pottery and other artifacts which were uncovered, a magnificent collection of frescoes adorned the walls of many of the buildings. The volcanic ash had acted as a protective layer, keeping the frescoes safe from the ravages of time and allowing us to appreciate their beauty thousands of years later. These findings were indeed confirmed to hail from the Bronze Age Minoan civilization, a society that flourished on the islands of Crete, Santorini, and other Aegean islands from around 3000 to 1450 BC. Each of the frescoes helps to tell a story, a snapshot into this bygone era. They depict a spectrum of life, from religious rituals to daily chores, offering us a unique opportunity to understand the Minoan civilization and its people. They also depict Thera's role as a thriving trading center with links to Crete, the Cyclades, mainland Greece, and Egypt, showcasing a society that was highly advanced and sophisticated, with a deep appreciation for art, nature, and religion. These frescoes were not just decorative pieces of art, they served a specific purpose and were an integral part of the architecture of the buildings. Each fresco was designed to complement the function of the room it adorned, creating an atmosphere that reflected the activities taking place within those walls. Whether it was a room for social gatherings or a space for religious rituals, the frescoes enhanced the ambiance, adding depth and context to the Minoan way of life. Minoan artists employed specific techniques. This involved first covering the stone wall with clay that was mixed with straw, then covered with a thick layer of plaster, and then thin layers of thin plaster would be applied successively on top. As the plaster dried, the pigments were absorbed, becoming an integral part of the wall itself. Even after thousands of years, the colors remain strikingly vivid, capturing the essence of Minoan life in a way that words simply cannot. It's this unique blend of artistry and technique that makes the Akrotiri frescoes a timeless testament to the Minoan civilization. Among the many frescoes found in Akrotiri, some stand out for their unique insights into the Minoan civilization. The Boxing Children fresco, for instance, depicts two young men engaged in boxing, possibly as a ritual sport, offering a glimpse into the athletic practices of the time. The Fisherman fresco portrays a male figure offering his catch to the gods, reflecting the importance of fishing in the Minoan economy. And the Spring fresco, with its bold colors and heavy strokes, depicts lilies and swallows, a testament to the Minoans' appreciation for nature and their keen observation of their surroundings. Today, these ancient masterpieces are carefully preserved and displayed in two significant locations. Frescoes, such as the Spring fresco, the Antelope's fresco and the Boxer's frescoes, have found their home in the National Archaeological Museum in Athens, Greece. This museum is one of the country's most important cultural institutions, ensuring the preservation and study of these ancient works of art. Many other frescoes, such as the Blue Monkey's fresco, the Ship Procession fresco and Fisherman fresco, are displayed in the Museum of Prehistoric Thera in Fira Santorini, just a stone's throw from where they were discovered. This proximity to their original location offers a unique opportunity to view these insightful works of art in a context that's intimately connected to their origins. The Akrotiri frescoes are truly a remarkable treasure that takes us back in time to the ancient Minoan civilization. These beautifully preserved wall paintings offer a unique glimpse into the daily life, culture, and artistic techniques of this fascinating civilization. They serve as a testament to the Minoans' advanced society and their deep appreciation for art and nature. As we wrap up our journey through the Akrotiri frescoes, 
We hope you've gained a deeper understanding and appreciation for this incredible civilization and its enduring legacy. Thank you for joining us on this journey back in time. If you enjoyed this video, please like it and subscribe to the channel to learn more about Santorini.